well, being in some nice new facilities should help. So I hear that uh, they're really going to have to rush to get them ready and get in there by August. But the good news is the ribbon's been cut, $85 million facility. So Florida obviously is lagged behind in certain areas, but catching up. Yeah, Mark, they'll get this big new facility built. And it does look like players will probably be able to move in sometime in July to be able to take part in a lot of the facilities, all of the activities and workouts and stuff they can do in that. The locker room will be in there now as well instead of in the bowels of the stadium. And Florida would have to go to the stadium and get dressed in the locker room and then walk across the street to the practice facility. And, you know, Mark, it just wasn't very practical uh, for years at Florida. Everything will be all encompassing. There's one big now uh, nice facility that Florida will have. Uh, and like I said, the, the players will be able to probably take part in it late July. I think a lot of the coaches' offices are going to be in that building too, but that's going to be a little bit later uh, in, in the process, probably in the August time frame there. But as long as you can get those players in there, Martin. And the most important thing is it's – nearing completion as we hit this summer month so now you can start showing recruits a little bit more about this facility it's not just the renderings it's not just the drawings of this nice grand exhibit of a of a of a, of a facility now you actually get to show some tangible progress and some tangible items with, to go along with this and mark you know talking about recruiting and you know why did jim McElwain struggle why did dan mullen struggle was facilities part of it absolutely and but it wasn't the whole story i always like a facility to maybe be one of those tiebreakers or something to go along when you're in those big battles with all those big schools are they going to alabama for facilities yeah but they're also going to alabama for a lot of other things they're also going to georgia for a lot of other things so do facilities matter yes you can't lag behind but they're not the sole focus of it you have to do it to keep up uh, Florida was way behind in, in, in that regard for years. They didn't think they needed them for the longest time. Uh, but in, in the, today's age, you got to impress off the field, Mark, as much as you do on the field. Uh, and that will be, you know, Florida. Florida won't have that excuse to, to, to fall back on anymore. Florida will be caught up in the facilities arm race.